how to build a business credit line in three days. Yes, you heard that right. Are you ready to get hundreds of thousands of dollars of business funding in your business's name and possibly with no personal guarantee? Well, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it step by step. Let's go. Noel. Yeah, she can fix that. If you gotta get it done, all you need to do it better. Well, she can fix that. Yeah, she can fix that. Investment to get back, trying to get a big step. She can fix that. Let's fix that. So let's first talk about business credit versus personal credit because this is so important. So many people do not know that there is a big difference between business credit and personal credit. So let me quickly tell you the differences. When it comes to personal credit, which is what most of us know about, we know that there are three credit bureaus, TransUnion, Equifax, and Experian. And on those credit reports, what do they usually report? They put trade lines up there of all of the different credit lines that you have taken out. So all of your credit cards, all of your mortgages, all of your car loans, all of your student loans. Those will all report on your personal credit report as trade lines. And if you pay those accounts on time, if you don't run your credit cards up and things like that, you will have an excellent FICO credit score in the personal credit world. As most of you guys know, you want a credit score over 700. That is a good personal credit score. And that is how most people will be able to use credit and access different credit cards, lines of credits, and things like that in their personal name. So let me tell you about another amazing world, and that is the world of business credit. So when it comes to business credit, they are looking at something entirely different than they are with personal credit. All of your personal credit cards, all of your auto loans, your student loans, none of those things will report on your business credit report. Same like with personal credit, there are still three credit bureaus. Instead of Experian, Equifax, and TransUnion, you have Experian Business, Equifax Business, and you have a new player, Dun & Bradstreet. When it comes to business credit, Dun & Bradstreet is the major business credit reporting agency. And just like personal credit, they will report all of your trade lines, the different accounts that you have, but now only the accounts that are in your business's name. So just like you have personal credit cards and student loans, you can get all of those same things, well not student loans, you can get in your business's name and it will report only to the business credit report. And this was life-changing and mind-blowing for me because when I started my business, I did not know about business credit and I literally tanked my own personal credit score investing in my business. I was buying letters and I was making signs and I was doing all of these things and I was using my own personal credit cards and my personal credit score tanked. Let me tell you what you can do with business credit because it is amazing. So step one to getting this all done, now that you know and understand the differences between personal and business credit, is start getting business credit. That's probably the biggest mistake that I made in my business and one of the things that I feel like held me back where I had to keep working before I could become a full-time entrepreneur. I literally now have students that are able to access business funding in weeks, not years, and they're able to quit their jobs and work in their businesses full time. So let me tell you how you get it done. The first step is going to be to set up a business. I know this sounds super easy and you're like, duh, Noel, but most people just completely skip this step and they feel like, well, I do this, I do photography, or I do wedding cake design, or I do whatever business I do, and that is my business. But if you wanna start getting business lines of credit and you wanna do this fast, step one, you're going to have to set up your business. Let me tell you what that means. So the awesome thing with business credit is you can get this set up in one day, depending on what state you're in. So the first thing that you're going to need is a business license, a business registration. You're going to need an LLC, which stands for Limited Liability Company, or you can do a C Corp or an S Corp. Again, you go to your state's secretary of state and you register your business. So if you are, for example, have a business and you call it ABC Properties, you will go to the secretary of state, for example, and put it and see if ABC Properties LLC is available and you register that business. And again, in most cases, you can do this all online and it's really quick to do. The second thing that you're going to need to set up your business, super simple and again, completely free. The business registration you are going to have to pay for, but this part is free. You're going to need an EIN number, which stands for Employer Identification Number. This is like your business's social security number and it is amazing and again, absolutely free. 
you go to irs.gov again after you register the business you have to make sure you have an actual business registered before you do the EIN I'd also suggest and I'll give you a few other things that you're going to need you might do some of these things before you get the EIN number but you want to get the EIN number as soon as you can because this is like when your business is kind of started and when people look to see when you got this and what date you got this for the age of your business so you want to do this as quickly as possible you don't want to wait a long time to do this and again completely free at irs.gov the next thing and again super simple you'll need a professional phone number a professional email and a professional website many times you can you can do this all in one day okay one day this is not anything that's difficult to do and this will set up your business in a legal way where you can actually accept payments and start making money and get funded so let's get to that part. So once you have these things set up, you are definitely on your way. You are literally probably 80% ahead of most business owners just by doing those simple things that I said, those five things, getting your business registered, getting an EIN number, professional phone number, professional email, and professional website, okay? Just doing those five things and those five steps will put you ahead of so many other businesses and put you in a position where you can start getting funding really fast. So let me tell you what happened with me because I did not do this and I waited way too long to start getting business funding but now I have millions of dollars in business funding, business credit cards, business lines of credit, business loans, like you name it, I've got it. And you can repeat this business after business after business. This is a process that you can duplicate over and over as you start businesses. So there is no end to this, okay? So I literally started investing in real estate from my parents' basement, okay? Some of you guys know me, I'm a real estate entrepreneur, millionaire, mom of five, and I mentor. But I did not start there, guys. I literally started in my parents' basement. I was um, bankrupt with tons of foreclosures. We had tried to flip houses, and then when the market crashed in 2008, 2009, we lost everything, and I literally ended up back in my parents' basement, dejected, embarrassed, and broke. <laughs> okay? So I had to start investing in real estate with bad credit and no money. All right? And I did. And there's some ways that I've taught you guys that you can do that but business credit is going to unlock something and you don't even have to deal with your personal credit at all in some cases. You literally can start a business profile and forget about personal credit altogether and just rely on your business's credit and create other companies and other businesses and create credit profiles for those businesses as well and get hundreds of thousands of dollars for every business that you have. So you don't have to make the mistake that I did Follow these steps and let's start getting you business funding today. So the next thing that you want to do, and this is how you are going to literally unlock business lines of credit. And I literally cannot believe that I did not know this because I have students that are doing this right now and getting hundreds of thousands of dollars. OK, so the next thing that you want to do, like I said, you do those five things. You want to make sure you have a business checking account. OK, now when you go to get your business checking account, you're going to need the business license, the EIN number. But it's very simple and again, completely free. You're going to put the money in your bank account and it's your money. You can take five hundred dollars or a thousand dollars or whatever the minimum is and get you a business checking account. Now, here's my recommendations. You don't want to go to the largest bank. So we have the large banks, Bank of America, Wells Fargo, Citi and Chase. Those are not going to be the best banks for a small entrepreneur. You really want to start off with some of the mid-sized banks, you know, Regions Bank, bb and Bank of Ozark, PNC Bank. I mean, I could just go on and on. It's like that next medium-sized bank. I think I, I think you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, not the large four, but that next tier of bank, because those banks have a lot of money for small businesses. Every administration, we already know it, puts money somewhere. And this administration has put a lot of money into businesses and there's a lot of funds available at banks for businesses. It's incredible. This is historic, guys. This, these numbers are unheard of. So now when you go to get that business checking account, literally, I have students that are getting offers for business credit cards and business lines of credit on the spot. Yes. And again, this credit card is not reporting on their personal credit so they can use it as they please, get funding, you know, get things for their business and not affect their personal credit score. Because when you went and got that checking account, they already checked your credit. OK, they literally already checked your personal credit. And if you have good personal credit, literally right now in this time that we are in with all of this availability of funds for businesses, they are offering businesses funds on the spot. So take advantage of it. 
And as a bonus, because this is Noelle and I always just have to tell you everything because I can't help it. I'm successful and I want you to be successful too. I'm gonna give you a bonus and I'm gonna actually put a link in the box. There's literally a company called North One that will allow you to access funds from anywhere. You can hook it up with your PayPal. You can hook it up with your Square. Again, these are merchant processing accounts. I have videos that I've made. I'll put a link to them in the description box for you. So you can watch those videos as well. If you have personal credit issues, you can still get access to these funds. There are so many funds available for businesses right now. You should not be waiting. This is something you should do. Get your business registered and start going after those funds, especially while you don't need them. You don't want to wait until your business is in trouble, where you're behind on payments to start trying to borrow money. You want to borrow money when you don't need it, when you're getting started, when you are using projections. And that is a way to start getting a lot of funds for your business really quickly. So I put a link below with North One. They will allow you to do all of these different things and you can access it right from your phone. It's an awesome company. I absolutely love them. And this is going to be a game changer for you guys. So click that link below and check them out because it's absolutely free. And North One Bank is a bank that can really help you out with some of this stuff. Okay guys, so there you have it. I have given you all of the information. You literally can start getting a business credit line in three days, depending on what state you live in. Literally have students doing that, setting up their entire business, getting their business checking account, and then getting offers from banks for their business. Additionally, if you need to wait a couple of months and get some bank statements, I have students that have waited like three or four months and started getting business funding, again, in their business's name. So make sure that you have all of this information and you actually implement on it. Please make sure you click that like button. I've shared so much information. Subscribe to my channel and click that little notification bell so you don't miss any of this content that I am bringing to you every single weekday. And make sure you check out North One. Again, the link is below. It's absolutely free. I absolutely love this company and I think this is a great resource for you. This is Noelle to your success. Thank you.